Here we are going to look at how to remove a control bar when presenting in Google Slides. So first let's assess the problem and then the solution. So you'll notice this is an unpublished um, slideshow I've got going here. Something to do with another project I'm working on. Now if you notice very carefully, firstly I'm going to go to the bottom and I'm going to hit the pointer, the laser pointer, and so I can talk about the top. Oh look, it's 500 feet pictures. The moment I go down and when I start to hit about the bottom third or bottom quarter here we go look that massive menu bar turns up which is pretty annoying because if I wanted to come down here and say highlight the word that's behind I have to wait one to about three seconds and it disappears the moment I move it it comes back again what so this is the solution so we go back and there are two steps to this solution it's a very good one because you can go in and you can say to yourself Google Slides hide presentation menu. I'm going to ignore that top one and the one I want or quite honestly the one I trust is how to remove the control bar when presenting which is at product forums Google. So when you open that up it looks like this. Now the first thing you'll see is it says change and I'm going to change the end piece to preview. Okay when I say the end piece I mean this. So I'm going to go along and I'm going to present again this time I'm going to take it out of full screen and you'll notice it says edit a load of um, numbers and letters. So all I'm going to do is I'm going to type in preview and I'm going to hit enter. Then it comes up like this. Now when I go back to full screen and I can go full screen, you know, by F, uh, was it F12 or that bit, now I can choose my uh, pointer and although I've got a permanent Google Slides grey menu bar down at the bottom, which quite honestly is really useful, and I think for me to do a talk and, and actually say, um, the question comes in, oh, on slide two you said whatever, whatever, and, and there we've got it, look. If I go into settings, I can still open up the editor, speaker notes and stuff, but more importantly, I can, if you like, just go through and I can scroll in the normal way. Yes, um, I've got a bit of a black border on the left and the right. I know that. I can see it. It's not terrible. But if you go back to the full solution, and this is where it gets quite interesting, what you've got to do, and now if we're up to number six, select element. So let's try this. And the bit that I'm going to copy is this bit about punch view and nav. And I'm just going to copy that beforehand. So what you're actually doing is you're going into inspecting the element, deleting this text string, which is about that, hitting enter and the whole thing will disappear. So let's try it. So what we do now is we go into full screen and then if I can get this right, we right click and we inspect. And there is my um, or our Chrome thing turning up. Control F to select uh, to find some text in the HTML and then paste in. Now what you'll see is the punch viewer nav and punch viewer nav blah -dee blah there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to double click it and where it says yeah I'm just going to reselect it. I'm not, I'm not great on HTML coding but you know you can get by. I googled it and then I'm going to hit delete okay then I'm going to hit enter and then I'm going to minimize that and look what's happened the whole thing has turned around where we're still going through our slideshow but this time there is no menu bar at the bottom albeit if I go to the bottom I did have actually let's click that once yeah if I go to the bottom oh when I was going to the bottom earlier on a few minutes ago when I did it my uh, windows like auto hide um, taskbar was turning up. You can see there's a slight black border on the left, slight black border on the right. If I want to right click I can exit full screen and what have we got here this time? That's interesting. Look, can you see that there's like a little um, forward and Anyway, look, that is it. Don't want to waste anybody else's time, but I'll put a link into the YouTube description of exactly what I've done here, and that's how to remove the thing. So there's my slideshow. It's interesting because that won't go, will it? So if I wanted to get this back again, I presume I would 
preview I would just do the coding wouldn't I so if I refresh that interesting point for those who yeah that look that's good enough isn't it we're on preview and we've still got the menu bar at the bottom if I went up to say full screen even on full screen there I think I could live with that very nicely to say here is my presentation I know what slide number I'm on you know you also know what slide number I'm on and then we can actually bring in our pointer this time and I can say nature see photo health well-being and calm right to the bottom and top left right especially the bottom look of my laser pointer and I don't get that annoying menu pop up and I waste a couple of seconds every single time there you go what a wonderful world we live in